Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Craig Caperso, Cellucor athlete, and today we're going to take you through the ultimate chest workout. Today's workout is going to take you through eight exercises. We're going to take you through different modalities such as Tabata, cluster sets, AMRAP, and ascending rep ranges. So let's get to it. So today we're going to start you off with seated machine flies. The modality here is going to be Tabata. We're just trying to get you warmed up dynamically. So we're going to heat up that muscle, bring blood action to the muscle bellies, and get you primed and ready to go. So Tabata is going to be 20 seconds followed by 10 seconds of rest repeated eight times over the course of four minutes. So it's something to just get you warmed up. So now that you're warmed up, we're going to get you an incline dumbbell press. We're going to be taking you through different rep ranges off of your one rep max of 65% for 15 reps, 75% for 10 reps, and 85% for 5 reps. Two minutes rest between sets, so we're going to take a little bit and then hit it again. Form tips here, make sure your elbows are locked in at your side by your lats, and then on the way down, about three seconds, one, two, three, press. Three seconds down, two seconds up. So we're building off a of volume here through stress and intensity. Strength is also a component of neurological output, so we're doing something called cluster sets on the next one. It's going to be bench press with a barbell. A cluster set is typically something that you're going to take about 85% of your one rep max. You're going to be doing anywhere between four to six reps between a 10 and 20 second rest. That is typical. So I'm going to modify this cluster set. We're going to actually go for 12 reps is the capacity here. So we're going to take that 85% of our one rep maximum, use that as the weight that we're going to target. We're still going to take between 10 and 20 seconds rest, but we're going to lift that load as many times as we can per set before we you know, naturally fail with form. Rest yourself 10 to 20 seconds and repeat until you achieve 12 reps. Then end the set, you got three minutes rest. The next cluster set here is gonna be also bench press with a barbell, but we're gonna go for a four minute time cap. So no longer do you have a, a set rep count, but you have a time limit. So we're gonna basically keep the same weight over the course of four minutes and see how many reps you can total. So cluster set protocol is probably gonna be something like this. You're probably gonna get three reps or something very close to that on your first try. After 10 to 20 seconds, you might get down to two reps. Make sure the form's good. Continue to rest between 10 and 20 seconds and repeat one rep until the desired outcome, either 12 reps or four minutes. So our next set here is going to be also a four minute time cap. We're going to basically do as many reps as possible in this combination. We're going to do Sven press from a dumbbell position off the chest, lying horizontally, and then taking it to a pullover. What we're going to be doing is about 50% of our one rep max here because you're going to have four minutes to do this exercise. It's going to get taxing. Sven press form cue here. Make sure you're doing an isometric squeeze, pushing the palms together with that dumbbell. And then when you bring it up and press, small reprieve, turn it into a pullover. Repeat this exercise as many times as you can in four minutes. All right, we're gonna take you down to a seated machine fly again. So we're gonna do a unilateral ascending rep style this time. Bring the weight up. We're gonna do something about 75% of our one rep max. All right, so unilateral ascending reps work like this. You're gonna do one with the right, one with the left, two with the right, two with the left, all the way up until six. You're gonna be 21 total reps here. We got two minutes rest, 75% of your one rep max. Let's go. So we're going to finish this thing off with push-up Tabata, but it's going to be push-ups, it's going to be explosive push-ups. At the bottom of this exercise, we're going to lift our hands up just slightly so we can really force them down against the ground and push ourselves up. I'm really trying to get you guys to explode off the ground. 20 seconds of intensity, 10 seconds rest, 8 sets over the course of 4 minutes. Let's do this thing. This workout's designed to build your strength and endurance. I mean, we're taking an 85% load, you know, over the course of a small amount of time. So our intensity and neurological output is going to be through the roof. So we're taxing our CNS. This workout's probably good every other week. So if you guys have any questions for me, find me on social media at Crecoverso, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, YouTube. Now, if you like this workout, make sure you follow all the other ultimate workouts just like this here at Audible.com. And if you guys like this content, make sure you subscribe below.